two teens face kidnapping charges accused of stealing a car with three kids inside. One, an infant who was left at a farmhouse. We begin in the courtroom where 18 year old Tate Wolf of Kearney faces multiple felonies. Just before 3 a.m. Sunday, Grand Island police got a call about a stolen SUV. Officers found it minutes later, but they learned three kids were inside and missing their ages five, one and seven months. GIPD says Wolf allegedly admitted leaving the infant on a random farmhouse porch. 17 year old Joseph McAllister faces the same charges plus account of obstructing an officer. Police say they that he resisted arrest. The man who found the baby boy thought he was too late. Wind chills were dangerously cold and the child had little to protect him. But as Steve White reports, fast action may have saved a life. That baby was found on this porch and may have been there two hours. And when the folks here found that child, they feared the worst. It looked pretty gruesome for a while. Momentary fear struck Chuck Sorahan as he looked at the boy in the car seat, cold with no sign of life. Well, his eyes were closed and he was, the little hands were up on his chest and he was, I, I, I was thinking the worst at that point. He brought the child inside his rural home by the fireplace. He was very cold. Didn't had a little thin blanket on and that was it. It brought resolution to an ordeal that started two hours earlier with wind chills of 20 below. Grand Island police say two teens stole an SUV with three kids inside. A five year old and a toddler were found a short distance away, but police say the seven month old boy was dropped at what they describe as a random farmhouse. The home of Chuck and Suzanne Sorahan. I was thinking it was pretty close to two hours, which was incredible because when I first picked him up, I wasn't, wasn't very, it was kind of agitated. Sorahan was prompted to look after an alert woke him from bed. Across the county, people heeded the call to check their property. He's setting bond. Now two men face charges. Tate Wolf is 18. His jaw dropped as a judge set bond at 10% of a million dollars. 17 year old Joseph McAllister faces charges as an adult, both accused of kidnapping and child abuse. I think we're very fortunate that um, we're not here on charges related to the deaths of those children. The alert on his phone startled him to action. That sound was followed by the child's silence. Then the sound better than the sirens. He was crying and it was the best cry I'd ever heard, honestly. <laughs> yeah. Both suspects will be back in court in a month. Reporting near Alda, I'm Steve White. Steve, thank you for that report. The Grand Island Police Department also releasing more information on the parents of the three children who were kidnapped, saying, quote, they didn't do anything wrong and are victims too. The parents had warmed up their car and put the three kids inside when, according to police, they engaged in a very brief conversation with neighbors. And at that exact time, the car was stolen. This timeline of events has been confirmed by video evidence.